Hey, Selton, congrats on the win. Um, it's been a rough go for you shooting the last couple of weeks. Where did uh, those clutch baskets come from today? Um, Coach Weber just kept saying, with few wide open, just shoot the ball. Don't hesitate. That's what I did. I know I missed the first one, but like, second one was the same, was the same shot. I was wide open, so I just took the shot. How, uh, obvious question, but just how good does it feel to win after everything you guys have been through? Yeah, we've been through a, a rough season. We needed this win. We needed like more more wins like since the, the other game. So we needed this win for sure. And it feels great. It feels great to get a win. Since December, we didn't get a win. So it feels great to get a win now. And um, Mike was very complimentary of your defense tonight. What did you think you did best in that area? Uh, just just being on people's chest, just stay strong on ball, um, def uh, defense on ball screens, and just stay in the right spots on, on help defense, and then sleek on transition. All right. Thanks, Selton. Congrats again. Appreciate you. Other questions for Selton? Next question to Tim Fitzgerald. Hey, Selden, when uh, you cut loose that three pointer, did did it feel good from the time you uh, let it let it go? Yeah, it felt great. <laughs> yeah. Felt good. Felt good. Yeah, and um, do you feel like you, you've had just a few games here down the stretch, Texas, most notably, that if you'd had one more three pointer, one more rebound, you might have gotten over the hump like you did today? I did. You're right. Um, I mean, like I said, being rough, them past two games being tough for me, didn't shoot the ball well, didn't, didn't really play well, but like, it just keep motivating me to like for the next, for the next game. So that's what happened today. And do you feel like your defense kind of took the pressure off your offense? I know some players feel that way when they really focus on defense, they don't have time to think about that offense. Um, sometimes, sometimes I'm not gonna lie. Sometimes it takes. Uh, how fun was the locker room? Oh, it was fun. It was fun. Like, we needed this win. Everybody was happy. Throwing water at each other. Everybody did a good job today, even at the bench. So we all, we all, we all was happy with each other. Congratulations. Thank you. Next question to Michael Goins. Yeah, so you scored seven points in the last uh, basically three minutes, 40 seconds or so. Um, what kind of gave you the confidence that you had that run in you and that you guys could get close it out today? Uh, just to the, the shots the game gave me, just kept playing hard, kept rebound, kept playing defense. And then when I t had the had opportunity to take the shots, I just took it. And you got a score in transition. Did that kind of get you going there in the last, last five minutes? Yes, sir. What was your main effort on uh, Nimhard? Would you try to deny the most against him? Uh, just fighting against ball screens because they have a big, uh, big, big man. He's like seven, seven, one, and then he's big, he's wild. So like just fighting through the screens and get back on on Nimhard was kind of hard, but like I did what I had to do, what coach asked me to do because I had good body, good physicality to do what he what he asked me to do. So I just did it. Yeah, that seven-footer is Kevin Samuel. How tough was he to go up against when you got in the lane today? Oh, he was tough. He was tough. He was one time that I had a wide open leg, but like he came to my body and then I just lost control because he was so big. How do you feel like this can propel you guys going forward now? Uh, it feels great. Um, we had games like that the whole year, but like I feel like we um, we. Put our head down, but today, even when it was down four, we just kept going. Coach keep motivating us. We keep motivating each other, and then we got the win.